Every great moment in our history began with a dream. Each bold leap forward was achieved by those willing to do anything to attain it. We are, all of us, leaving behind families, homes, the very birthplace of our species. Some for discovery to see the unknown, others for a new start. But today, whatever our reasons, we take the first steps toward a new future for humanity. Today, we begin to make our dream reality. Deep breaths. You're gonna wanna take it easy. I've been taking it easy for 600 years. Ryder, Sarah, Recon Specialist, Pathfinder Mission Team. Pathfinder Team, eh? The ones finding us a home. Can you make it somewhere tropical? Nice, warm ocean, summer year-round? How about we get her a cup of coffee first?
selection process saw the Andromeda Initiative evaluate thousands of potential habitable planets within the galaxy. Sarah Ryder, let's get you checked out. Look here. After discovering an unusually high ratio of potential candidates, or Golden Worlds, the Helios Cluster was selected as our destination. Now you are a part of the first wave of ARCs arriving in Andromeda, our new home for humanity. Makes it sound so easy, doesn't it? I hope not. I signed up for a little adventure before we settle down. Well, buckle up. Sounds like you'll get your wish. Yeah? Over here now, the Pathfinder wants you all on your feet right away. He said mission ready within the hour. Any idea why? No, but I'm guessing that's where your adventure comes in. Okay, everything checks out. Just one more thing before I send you on your way. Let's test your SAM implant. Sam, are you monitoring? Sam, are you online? Yes, Dr. Tapero. Good morning, Sarah. Are you feeling well? I feel like a 600-year-old popsicle. I hope we pack more coffee. Readings confirmed. Based on the levels of adenosine in your system, the neural implant is functioning properly. Wait, adeno what? It just means you're still shaking off your nap. No reason why we can't get you on your way. Though you may want to hang around while we revive your brother. It always helps to see a familiar face. I don't like the sound of that. I think so. What happened? We're not sure. Sensors are scrambled. But it's good to see you're up. Feels like centuries since we spoke. This is the Pathfinder. Mission teams continue preparations. Cora, riders, report to the bridge. You heard him. Let's get- Uh, we have a problem over here. It's Scott Ryder. What's-
I don't know. Have to check it out. Well, it looks like some sort of power surge hit the stasis pod. Sarah, is my brother okay? Scott's fine. His vitals are strong, but the revival procedure was interrupted. When can he wake up? We don't want to rush it. Sam? My connection to Scott's implant was suspended. However, his pulse, respiration, and brain activity are all normal. To be on the safe side, we'll need to keep him in a low-level coma for a while. Then let his body regain consciousness naturally. He'll be fine. Glad to hear it. Thanks, Lexi. Keep us updated. Ryder, I'll wait for you at the door, whenever you're ready to go. You ready? What's wrong? Hey! Up here! Whatever hit the arc fried everything. We have to balance the power load or it could explode. But we don't know where the fault is. Ryder could find it. She has a scanner. Quick, Ryder. Use it to locate the fault. On it. I'll try to get readings on the second conduit. Hey, There's no indication of a fault in this component. Keep Got looking. Relay 2C shows damage from a temperature spike. Found it! Bad relay! Ryder! Can you go reset it? There! It's reset! Good job, Ryder. Now we can get to the tram. <sighs> that was close. Barely an Andromeda, and we're already scrambling. <sighs> the adventure begins. Not sure your dad will see it that way. The guy who knows it best is in stasis. Well, that's a problem. So I've got the semantics. That's pretty straightforward. Go ahead and take us to the bridge. Helm control, report. We're drifting. Flight controls aren't responding. First priority is stopping these outages. Mainline power's been knocked out. We're on reserves, Captain. They won't last. What's our position? Unknown. We lost telemetry. Sam, we need eyes out there. Attempting to adjust sensor array. Alec, please. You may be Pathfinder, but this is my ship. Captain, the protocol's clear. In the absence of communication with the Nexus or the other Arcs, we proceed to our appointed Golden World. Solid ground. If it's even out there. Nobody said anything about running into an energy cloud. And that's just a wild guess what we hit. Alec, I need to assess the damage. Stop the bleeding. We've got 20,000 people asleep on this ship. Let's give them a chance to wake up. Can you blame her? My father's got a point, though. Solid ground sounding pretty good right now. Yeah, but... Pretty good isn't good enough. Yes, sir. We're coming through. My god. Is that our golden world? That's Habitat 7. New Earth, if we're lucky. All of our long-range scans told us it was in the green zone. Perfect for human settlement. It doesn't even look the same. 
We don't know how bad it is yet. Still seems like it's our best shot. Maybe. There's just a lot on the line. Sam? The energy from the phenomenon is dumping our senses. Planetary conditions are unknown. We're marooned. 20,000 souls adrift at sea. And when the power runs out and stays out, we need to know if that's safe harbor. And if it's not? As Pathfinder, it'll be my job to find an alternative. It's what we trained for. But if this goes well, we are already home. All right, just make it quick. Harper, the rest of the team should be awake by now. Have them spin up two shuttles. Planet Fallen 30. Yes, sir. A stubborn one, isn't he? No one ever said Dad was a diplomat. People skills were never his strong suit. Just as long as he knows what he's doing. It's not like the cavalry's coming to save the day. I need an ETA on our sensor repairs. We're blind out here. My brother's going to hate that he missed this. Are all the riders adrenaline junkies? I guess it's in our blood. I was born a minute ahead of him. I never let him forget it. Don't worry. I'm sure Scott will pull through. Yeah, and when he does, he'll want to hear stories. So, let's get out there and find him one. Right, you'll want to get your helmet. And maybe stop at the good luck rock before we go. So. The what? It's an old superstition of your dad. Crashing the party, huh? Uh, sorry. Got it. That should do it. The pop. Hey, Ryder. It's Kirkland, right? Yeah. I think we met just before the Hyperion left Earth. Not sure if you know Greer. Hi there. You dad say anything about what's going on? It was all business. Told us to prep and be ready to go. Short and sweet, huh? Will do. See you guys on the ride down. No must, no problem. Better safe than sorry. You never know. Now let's get to the shuttles. Dr. Carlyle, with everything going on, I think the Ark needs you more than we do. Pathfinder wants a medic on hand, and if that is home down there, I'm happy to knock on the door. If it's what we hope it is, it'll be one for the history books. You got a quote ready? One small step. I'm pretty sure your dad will handle that honor. All right, team, button it up. We leave in five. Sir, we broke out the weapons as requested. Anything we should know about? Seem prudent, given the situation. We'll be down a man with Scott out. I heard what happened. Your brother's strong. He'll make it. He better. 600 year nap and he oversleeps. You know him. Never was an early riser. Just don't let it get to you. I need you sharp. Yes, sir. Your mom would have been proud. Of both of you. Okay, team, listen up. I chose each of you for the Pathfinder team, not just because you're talented and passionate, but because you're dreamers, like me. We dream of exploring the unknown, of finding the edge of the map, and then discovering what lies beyond. When people look back on this, and they will, they'll remember we didn't give up, that we kept dreaming, that our first few faltering steps in Andromeda were the beginning of everything they know. We only get one chance to be first. So, 
Let's go make history. I've been waiting 600 years for this. to be an unstable mass of dark energy. If you say so, steer clear of it. Gravity anomalies detected. Ryder, come in. Uh, Hyperion! Sam! Anyone there? Save your breath, Ryder. Sam's offline. Comlink's trashed. I'm surprised we aren't too. Did the others make it? I don't know. It was all a blur. Shuttle split in two. This is like some nightmare. Yeah. No way this is home. Looks like we gotta find some high ground. See if anyone else is alive. Come on! Ryder, how's your survival training? I've seen my share of troubles. Nothing crazy, but... Well, crazy just found us. Those rocks out there are floating. Terra Incognita. 
Oh, and safety tip? Don't breathe the air. Found that out the hard way. Got it. You think that energy cloud we saw could cause all this? Sam said it's dark energy, but that's in space. Yeah, hell of a cloud. A cloud? Uh, what the hell is this? Come on! We gotta get through it! This is crazy! Welcome to Habitat 7! Keep moving! Ah! Look safer under there! Is this for real? What the hell's going on with this place? How's your gun? Might wanna see if it's working. Take a shot at that fuel cell. It's busted anyway. Look. I'd say it's working! There! We get up that cliff, we find high ground. Come on! Not sure we want to be the tallest thing around here. I think I can see a path up. We'll use the jump jets if we have to. Into the breach! I think I'd rather fall than get... <sighs> More glowing mushrooms. Are they making that noise? No. Coming from inside the mountain. was a cop, then crisis response. Tell you over a beer sometime. That's it. We're getting there. Think I see the top. Mind making some room? Thanks. What the hell is that? Don't know, but it's our job to figure it out. That sounds like your old man talking. He was right. Something went wrong here. We have to find out what. One thing at a time. Ryder, it's Fisher. Deadly force unless fired upon. <laughs> yeah, said no one in the field ever. How do we handle it? Just be ready if this goes south. It usually does. Just say the word and I go hot. They haven't spotted us yet. Wrong. Shit! They see. there. Didn't think we could take the chance. Well, you saved my life. Be a hell of a thing to survive the crash only to get shot by aliens. Not letting that happen for anyone. <sighs> we still don't even know what they wanted. Nothing good the way they were on. 
Who says we'd even understand, or they'd understand us? It's a new galaxy. I guess it's too much to expect they'll play by Milky Way rules. Or any rules, by the look of them. But what did we do to them? Only thing I know for sure, their guns hit just as hard as ours. Where are the others? Gone. Kirkland and Greer went looking for help. Come on. Ah, my leg! Can you move? I think it's broken. You guys push ahead and look for the others. You sure? Yeah. Just find us a ride out of here. And take a few more of them out while you're at it. Whoa. Take a look at these bodies. What are these things? Well, I don't have Sam here, but I can try to make sense of it. They're DNA-based, and their armor reads as some kind of bone. But the genetics are all over the map. I hope the other team's okay. We'll find them, but we might want to scout around first. You're the recon specialist. Point the way. <laughs> right. Looks like you knew how to handle the gun back there. Spent time with an Alliance peacekeeping force. him in cold blood. He was trying to surrender. Why kill him? Would we treat them any different if they showed up on Earth, armed to the teeth? Uh, maybe not. Peace isn't going to be an option here. We'll come back for his body once we find the others. Hope Chris still alive somewhere. Still, take a look at this architecture. This is really something. I've seen Prothean artifacts in my time, but nothing quite like this. It's at least three or four centuries old. The Arcs left 600 years ago, right? Yeah. Our long-range scans wouldn't have shown this. These structures. That tower. Maybe none of it was here when we left the Milky Way. Shit! You hear that? I wish I did. The hell's that? Damn, watch out! What is this thing? I think it was- Okay. It's dead. Whatever it was, it's organic. No sign of technology. Wow, so the cloaking is biological? Yeah, weird. Hey look, flares going up over there. Could be our people. I'll mark the nav point. What do you suppose is down there? New and painful ways to die? Maybe we could jump jet our way across. Does that sound like 
sound coming from below? Um, alien gods of the underworld? <laughs> Don't see. see that. I think it's machinery. You can feel the vibration. Oh, the scale of this. Who built it? Alien gods. Ryder, more of those aliens ahead. They see us! Here we go! Not much for talking, are they? Look out! They're using those animals! Careful! They're cloaking! This is for Kirkland! Did it. <laughs> oh, you're pretty good at this, Ryder. I was with a team that dug up Prothean artifacts. Well, this will be a field day for you. I wonder what these guys were doing here. Crash of some kind. It's not one of our ships. It's food, I think. Definitely not from the Milky Way. One of theirs. Think the storm got it? At least the weather isn't playing favorites. You'd think if this was their planet, they'd know how to handle the storms. Ryder, some sort of cave over there. Check that out. Now this looks more like the golden world my dad was expecting. Then dead animal in here and some sort of trap. Pretty recent, too. You suppose those aliens set it? If it's anything like plants back in the Milky Way, there are signs of cellular mutation. It's lasted this long. Guess that makes it the Alpha Tree, huh? Yeah. Or what happened to all its friends outside? Wonder what's in here. What the? Did you see that? Some kind of flying thing. Add it to the list of stuff around here we don't understand. Mm-hmm.